We're going to turn now to tennis star Naomi Osaka. She spoke to the crowd after a tough loss over the weekend, getting tearful over being heckled. As you know, she's been very open about her mental health journey. Janae Norman here with the details. Good morning, Janae. Hey, good morning, George. It is unusual to hear from the losing player after a tennis match. It's something that's rarely done. But despite being emotional, Naomi Osaka decided to speak up, as she has before, bringing the conversation back to the issues of athletes and mental health. I feel like I've cried enough on camera, but oh. The four-time major champion and former world number one tennis player in tears. I just wanted to say thank you and um, congratulations. Naomi Osaka taking the mic after her second round loss to Veronika Kutermotova at the Indian Wells Masters. The 24-year-old requesting to address the crowd after being heckled by a spectator in the stands. Right there, listen again. A visibly upset Osaka asking the chair umpire to have the heckler removed, but the umpire rejecting her request. And I don't know why, but like it, it went into my head and I, it got replayed a lot. Osaka saying the setting reminded her of Serena Williams playing there in 2001. The crowd booing as Richard and Venus Williams watched her play. An incident the family calls traumatic and believes was racist. Both players boycotting the tournament for more than a decade. I'm trying not to cry. The 24-year-old, who's been open about her mental health struggles with anxiety and, quote, long bout of depression, even stepping back from the spotlight, withdrawing from last year's French Open after opting not to do media interviews against tournament rules. I honestly don't know when I'm going to play my next tennis match. <laughs> Sorry. And taking a four month break from tennis, but it's been a rocky return for the now 78th ranked Osaka. To kind of stop and assess where she is. I think it was a very smart move for her. There's so much we can learn from what some of these athletes are going through and hopefully to the point that they never have to go through it again. And of course, there are many who say the pressure and hecklers are all part of the game. There are many aspects of life where controlling your mind, dealing with the mental part of it is a big part of it. I think we can all agree we're watching a 24 year old struggle with how to handle all of that. Robin. All right, Janae, we appreciate you bringing that for us. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.